Watch a bitch. YouTube. In honor of the new Mario movie coming out? Oh, okay, hang on. In honor of the new Mario movie dropping? Got a little toad unboxing for you, bitches. In honor of the new Mario movie, got a little toad unboxing for you motherfuckers. In honor of the new Mario movie coming out this week, got a little toad unboxing for you freaks. Toad motherfuckers. YouTube got a toad unboxing. That is some YouTube shit. Hold up. YouTube got a toad unboxing. Hell yeah. Today, got a toad unboxing. Only get one shot at this. You can only truly unbox something one time. Uh, got the cutlery for it. We're gonna unbox this shit. The blade is nice and dull, but oh yeah, this is what you guys want to see. <laughs> you see how much freaking wear and tear this thing has, man? Of course, got toad. I'm gonna go ahead and slice this. We're gonna change stations. So far, only cut the tape off. Uh, so we're looking good so far. Part one of the unboxing is officially underway. Keep it tuned in for part two, new location. All right, we're back in. Part two of the unboxing is officially underway. Had to change scenery. I was a little scared that there might be a little bit of buzzing in the background. A huge box for such a small little toad. Oh yeah. Oh, this is the money shot, baby. Toad out the box. Uh, in the box, there's nothing else. Just toad and some plastic wrap. No over protection on this front part. Uh, let's get this, let's get it out the frying pan. That's what it looks like. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Perfect for flipping little eggs, man. Uh, it's not real metal. You cannot use this on your stove. Uh, but it is, oh, shit, I guess I gotta get a dot on the screen. Super easy to get out of the box, uh, out of the packaging. Uh, toad, head ass, just cheesing away. Played by Keegan Michael Key in the movie. Uh, honestly, pretty high quality figure. Uh, I mean, you know, you can look this way, look that way. You know, things, things you do. Uh, his backpack, you can actually looks like put the frying pan in there. That's sick. Uh, but the real question is, can he dab? Doesn't look like it. Not super high quality um, bending on the arms. I actually almost just ripped one out. Definitely a bummer he cannot dab. The feet move. I mean, to be fair, it is kind of a hard figure to have like a bunch of dexterity and flexibility in, but the toes, the feet go up and down, the head goes. Uh, like I mentioned, Toad cannot dab. I would honestly probably save your money. Do not buy this. The pan is really cool, but you can't actually use it yourself. Does it go in Toad's hand? Uh, hand just came off. That's kind of on me. I was being pretty rough trying to get him to dab. Uh, but you can do a little pan situation. But again, yeah, no dabbing, which is a bummer. Uh, pretty much the only reason that most people are gonna be looking to buy this figure. Uh, other than that, it is a pretty high quality figure. You'd probably be able to fit Toad's head in your mouth. Um, so that is definitely a plus. Uh, but overall, it's gonna look nice next to some Mario figures if you got them. And uh, if not, he'll look pretty cute just on his own. He's a little cutie patootie. So that's a review. Gonna give it a, a four out of 10 just because of the whole arm situation. And um, I think I mentioned this, he can't dab. So that is a huge disappointment and probably gonna be passing on this figure a second time. Not gonna be buying a second one. Uh, but if you want a figure, you can get, get one at your local, uh, at your local target, I think.